Hi, I'm Mark from Cumulus. The Cumulus platform provides real-time visibility into manual work activities across industries like energy, transportation, and infrastructure. Our field-ready platform is used by companies like Shell and Bechtel for a much-needed layer of digitalization for manual work. This improves project organization, productivity, and most importantly, safety. In this video, I'll give you an overview of exactly how the Cumulus platform is used to ensure that work is done right the first time, every time. I'll start by reviewing our workflow in the Cumulus Workflow Builder. Today I have an activity titled Flange Completion, which already has a preferred workflow associated. Now that I have the activity, I'll review the workflow to ensure that the process matches any specification and that any pictures, checklists, QC hold points, or other actions required to complete the process are correct. Now that we have a fully reviewed workflow and activity planned, we'll go out into the field to see how the Cumulus mobile app guides workers through the workflow. The Cumulus mobile app, available for iOS or Android, is used by field workers to review critical information, ensure process compliance, collect completion data, and provide updated work history. The first step will be to break down and inspect the flange. For simplicity, today we are going to break down and reassemble this red flange to collect data and document the first steps in our workflow. Upon reassembly, we'll go use the flange behind to demonstrate the tightening. We'll use a connected Bluetooth wrench to tighten the flange per the specifications required. Once paired, you'll receive a notification that the tool has been successfully connected. Once the worker is ready, they will begin tightening the bolts using the highlighted pattern on the screen. The target torque value is sent automatically to the connected tool by the mobile application. Once the worker has captured a successful torque value, the tool will vibrate and beep, and the bolt will turn green on the app on the screen. The worker can then move through the rest of the bolts using the same process. After completing all tightening passes, the torque values of each applied bolt will be recorded and the worker can click done and complete the tightening. After we complete the tightening, we have to go through the required tightening checklist. The steps for this checklist are to measure the alignment and the parallelism at 0, 90 degrees, 180 and 270, as well as verify that the proper lubricant was used. After that, we're gonna use an inspection process and take a photo of the completed work. Review our photos of the completed work. And now we've successfully tightened the flange. The first step in the QC process is to do everything we did in the past. Review the information about the connection, look at the location, the size, and in this case, we can see all of the work history that was done prior. I can look through the checklist to see the measurements. I can see the tightening passes. I can see any photos that were taken. I can see who did the work and what they did all live on the tablet. To progress with the QC check, I'm gonna go through an inspection checklist. I'm gonna check that the connection is properly aligned and seated. There's no signs of damage. And that the just overall workmanship is satisfactory. Again, I'm gonna take a photo of the installation. review the photos, and now our quality control process is done. The next step in our workflow is a field inspection by a quality control inspector. Similar to the earlier steps in our workflow, logging in under QC, QC workers can then scan the QR code on the bolts and conduct their inspection. Once the inspector approves the work, the data is synced and available on the control center for further review. Now that work is complete, we can shift back to our control center to review all the work that has just been completed. The Cumulus Control Center aggregates all the field data for your project into one centralized, organized location. This is most often used by project supervisors to monitor and review project details and progress. To review the data captured for the flange that we just worked on, I'll click on the Complete QA QC Past category. Reviewing the list of the flanges that are complete, I'll first identify the specific flange that I'm looking for. By clicking View Details, I'll be able to review the full details for this flange. In the Activity History tab, I can see that the QC completed work on our flange, as well as the date and time that occurred at. I can also access and review all the pictures that were taken by the field worker in the field. 
After reviewing that information, I'll go to the Completion Report tab to review the digital record of all work that has occurred on the flange. A digital check sheet that is automatically generated replaces paperwork with a faster, more organized, and safer report that shows exactly what work was done, what tool was used, and who did it. This availability of real-time field completion data and the automatic generation of digital completion reports is an incredibly powerful way to ensure that work done in the field is completed right the first time.